This scene will describe how an insect at rest starts the click mechanism. As in the previous scenes, the actions will be presented as exaggerated and slowly in sequence so they can be easily followed. Needless to say, besides the indirect flight muscles, there are other wing-related muscles in the thorax of insects that control wing twisting and for folding the wings over the abdomen as shown here. However, only those muscles that are directly related to starting the flight muscles will be discussed. The process starts when the insect brain stimulates neurons in the ventral nerve cord to activate the muscles involved in flight. Pleurosternal muscles are stimulated to undergo contractions that hold the thoracic pleurons stiff. Neuronal stimulation activates the two sets of flight muscles. Contraction of nodal trochanter muscles pulls down on the nodal and up on the base of the legs, thrusting the legs downward, especially the mesothoracic legs. This launches the insect into the air, at the same time lengthening the notum and stretching the activated dorsolongitudinal muscle. As described in the previous scene, a stretch of activated dorsolongitudinal muscles produces an instantaneous tension-twitch contraction cycle to shorten the notum and snap the wing into the downstroke, followed by instantaneous relaxation by the longitudinal muscles. Immediately, there is a counterstretch to the activated antagonistic dorsoventral muscles to start their stretch tension contraction relaxation cycle and snap the wings into the upstroke. This initiates the oscillating resonance wing beat in the thoracic box and the click mechanism for flapping flight. Let us see how this would look in a real life situation with the insect on a stationary surface. As the nodal trochanter muscles contract pulling up on the base of the legs and down on the nodal, the legs thrust downward and the wings flip up and start the wing beat so that the insect would essentially leap into the air from the surface. Loss of contact with the substrate by the feet stimulates a flapping reflex in insects, so once started, flapping continues until the feet contact another solid surface at landing. In summary, insects truly jumpstart their flight.